Hi everybody, Quint Lears, newhomesales.com. We've got a special treat. I'm here with Anna Keller. Anna, thanks so much for joining us. Hi Quint, thank you. Anna is a new home sales superstar and the recipient, the 2017 recipient of the 40 Under 40 Professional Builder Magazine recipient. Is that correct? Yes, that's correct. What an awesome, how did it feel to be um, a recognized in that category of leaders? And this is basically the leader, pe young people that are leading the industry in new home sales. How did that feel? Um, I think shocked is the word to use to describe it. I wasn't expecting it at all and what an honor it was to be recognized amongst the top professionals, young professionals in the United States. So it was very exciting. You should be proud. I know your team is very proud of you. Your family's very proud of you. I mean, even the, the local city where you're from is very proud. Tell me this, what did you do different? I know this is a very competitive category um, to win and receive that re recognition. What did you do different? It's hard to say what I did differently because I think a big part of it and a big part of my success has been my team. I wouldn't be able to have been received this award if it wasn't for my team and the company that supports me. So really it's more the team than the me. Very humble as well. Um, but tell me this, somebody like, okay, some trainings that you've done, some things that you've learned because I mean, you've been very successful both as a, a licensed real estate broker and uh, a new home sales professional. Now you're the director of sales uh, for Desert View Homes. Is that correct? Right. I'm the division manager for Desert View Homes. How has your career, so I'm going to give you, if you were giving some advice to a frontline new home sales professional, what would it be? They're just getting in the business. I mean, you've had a long successful track career. Um, even though you're still very young and you're just really at the beginning of it. But what advice would you give to a new professional just joined that doesn't even know where to begin? Training, finding the trainings that will benefit you. Also finding the mentors that will help guide you, lead you, help you, help you grow your career. And I think that's where you start finding those people that will help support you and also finding the training that will also help you grow into the person that you want to be, whether it's the person or the salesperson finding those. And I like what you said, that it's not just the technique, but it's also training to become the person. Who have been some mentors that have, you know, had a big impact on your life? I've been very blessed in my career that I've had a couple of great mentors. Um, I've worked for who I consider some of the best in the industry from the very first um, builder that I ever worked for, Paul Allen Holmes out of Albuquerque, New Mexico. Dan Barry, he's been my longtime business partner, one of the best salespeople that I know. And even now, currently, the leadership that I have with Desert View Homes, they've been true mentors to me as well. So, You've had a lot of different aspects, both, you know, frontline, new home sales, licensed real estate broker, you know, now you're the, you know, the division manager. Which, what do you, what, how has it, these different roles impacted you or what do you like or dislike about each role? They're all different. Um, the thing that I like the most is helping people. And when you're in sales, you're more one-on-one -on -one with the customer. You have that direct, you, where you can directly impact somebody's life, helping them owning a home. Um, now in the position that I'm in, I'm able to help more people. It's just more indirectly than directly. So, but still, you still have that, that, that feeling of just being able to help somebody own a home. That's what I love the most. And then Anna is actually the, doing a keynote speak here, speaking here. And um, so I'm, I know you're keeping, I know you're getting ready to do that talk. Um, just a couple more quick questions. Um, why push yourself this hard? I mean, so many people, and the reason I ask is because I was listening to a radio program today. It was like, you know, today's young people, they're just so happy with the status quo. They do, they do just the very bit, bare minimum to get paid, but you don't. You're pushing yourself every day um, in every way. Why? For one, I want to say that it was the way I was raised. I come from a hardworking family, and that's just my dad. He taught us that, you know, you work hard for what you want. Um, I'm a mother, so of course my children are my greatest motivation, and that's what pushes me every day to get up and work harder so that I can provide that life for them. Um, and then I think it's just the person that I am. You know, I, I want to succeed. I want to try hard. So that's what keeps me going every day. Well, I know you've got a big talk coming up. Um, any shout outs, anything you want to say? And again, this is a big honor. We're just here, you know, to pick your brain, but also just to celebrate with you uh, the honor that you've received. Any shout outs? Again, my team, the whole Desert View team, uh, I couldn't do it without them and my family, my children. 
Listen, congratulations, and uh, we'll look forward to seeing you up on stage here in a minute.